Okay, today's video we're going to be reviewing a comparison taste test between Outro Soya, no sugars, and then the just free Lidl brand dairy free soya sweetened. Please don't forget to subscribe for more awesome vegan food content. Sorry for the marks, it's been in my fridge for quite a while. Let's put it around like that, it looks a bit better. Okay, so unsweetened and sweetened we're going to take that into account but what we are also going to take into account is the fact that this costs one pound sixty this costs 59p 59p for a liter of soya milk okay that's absolutely insane that's cheaper than dairy milk which we know exploits cows and gets tons of subsidies from the government so this could be an absolute game changer if it tastes tastes not too bad. Let's get a, let's get a visual on the ingredients first. So ingredients on our friend Outpro, kind of the um, kind of the industry leader in soy milk, I would say. So this has yeah your soy base, and then it also has your calcium in. So even though it's not got any sugar in, it does have your calcium. So you then get the vitamin D, B12, and calcium, um, which is pretty good. So it matches regular cow's milk. Okay, so that's good. You've got the vegan logo on there. I mean, the Alpro packaging is lovely. You know, you know where you are with this. So I'm excited to have a bit of that. Unsweetened, obviously. So then we've got Just Free. And Just Free is the range from Lidl. They also do some yogurts, I think, which is free from dairy. So let's have a look at the ingredients here. So water, it's almost exactly the same. You've got your calcium again, so you get your v vitamin Calcium, your vitamin D and your B12. And then it should have some sugar, surely. Vitamins. Oh, apple extract. There you go. So it is sweetened, but it's been sweetened with apple extract, which is pretty neat. Okay, that makes sense. So pretty much similar. It's obviously going to taste a bit more sweet than the, our friend Alpro, but for the price, I'm very excited. Let's do a look test first. I'm going to give them both a shake. I've not got much left of the um, the little one because I've actually drunk quite a lot of it. So, so shaking up. So you're gonna get a bit of froth because I've just shaken it up. Okay. So this is your Outpro. I mean, you kind of know what to expect with the Outpro. Looks great. Bit of froth. Very nice color. Lovely texture as well. Looks looks great. Right. Let's do the little. Shake that up a bit. All right. Let's have a look. They both come in Tetra Pack. Okay, so that's the end of the pack, so it's a bit more frothy because you get that froth at the bottom, but looks identical. Absolutely identical. Okay, let's do smell. Smells like soy, soy milk, to be honest. <laughs> do they smell different though? Hmm. I'd say this smells a bit more creamy than this one. It smells very nutty. Um, but I mean that. Looks basically identical. Let's get the packaging in so you can tell which is which. I think they look identical. All right, let's get into the taste test. Okay, so I'm genuinely interested. I haven't tried these off next to each other. I've had them both, but never together. So I'm really interested to see what, what the taste test is. Okay, so let's start with the test. Kind of the, uh, what's it? The, the, the um, calibrate. Let's calibrate ourselves with the soy. Soy Alpro. Smells very nutty. Or like that nut kind of the soybean bean flavor okay let's try it remember this is unsweetened so mm. fresh very clean got a clean flavor text is great it's so creamy seeming that that's not not been um not getting sugar sugar in but also not been yeah that's good very nice. Not offensive, simple. Great texture. Okay, now have a quick drink of water. They always say when you're doing tasting, smell your hand. If you're doing smell test, it resets your, your nasal, nasal passages for the smell. Okay, right. We're now moving on to little, just free. Let's go. Can't really smell that much, guys. 
I mean, does it smells creamier and a bit obviously sweeter, but that's the problem. It it's less that roasted soy kind of smell. It smells very faint, but definitely sweeter. Okay, let's have a go. Mm. Do you know what? That's actually really interesting that it's got apple extract because it tastes sweetened, but not sweetened as in when you have sugar in it, like pure sugar, cane sugar, for example. It's really faint. It's not because I have a lot of the some of the Alpro sweetened. You're like, boom, hits you. It almost tastes like a can of Coke, like that real sugary taste. But that's very, very faint, actually. I'd be interested to see how much sugar it has. Yeah, that's good. Mm. So per 100 milliliters, Alpro sugar, zero. Lidl sugar, 2.4 grams. So it is sweetened, but hardly at all. So that's really interesting. And then your vitamin D and all vitamins are exactly the same. So half the price, is it worth it? 100%. However, Alpro is still great. Alpro is still great. You're good, steady. You know what you're going to get. But 59p, I mean, come on, it tastes... I think it tastes nicer than the no, no sugar, um, but obviously it's slightly sweetened, but it doesn't taste chemically at all. We know the ingredients are, are legit. So I would say definitely, if you're ever in Lidl, check this out as it smashes dairy out of the park. See you in the next video.